frictional force learning outcome student will recognize that the friction is a force that opposes motion place a block of wood on a table and give it a quick push the block first slides and eventually slows down to stop this has happened because of a force which opposes the motion of the block this opposing force is known as frictional force we see this young girl riding the bicycle and understand that as she stop pedaling the bicycle start slowing down here the bicycle slow down as the frictional force opposes the motion of the bicycle this frictional force slowing things down or prevents things from moving when one object moves or tries to move over the surface of another object the frictional force start acting on the contact surfaces it always opposes the motion there is a friction between tire of the bicycle and the road which finally stop or brings the bicycle to a halt since the force of friction arises due to contact between surfaces it is a contact force now let us learn about a situation where we can find frictional force in action we observed a moving car it slows down to a stop at a traffic signal this happens because of the force of friction between the brake and the wheel of the car the brakes come in contact with moving wheels of the car and slow down the car hence we understand that frictional force occurs when objects come in contact with another object just like the brake and the wheel of the car the frictional force acts in opposite direction to the way an object wants to move this result in the stopping of the car what else can a frictional force do push a heavy box and try to move it we observe that it does not move at all initially it is frictional force which prevents the box from moving and box does not move when you apply small force now increase the force to a level where you can take up the help of your friend and you observe that the box start moving this happens as sufficient amount of force has been applied to the box which helps to overcome friction and the box start moving when we push this box from left to right the frictional force acting in an opposite direction from right to left in the same way when we push the box from right to left the frictional force acts from left to right therefore the frictional force always opposes the motion of an object and acts in a direction opposite to the force applied to summarize frictional force is a force that slows down moving object or prevents stationary objects from moving frictional force acts between pair of surfaces in contact frictional force acts in a direction opposite to the force applied